don't miss any content, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Hey guys, welcome back to Sahara Football. As usual, I am your host, Selassie Fiawe. So, recently, over the weekend, Heather Renard, former assistant coach of the Ghana Black Stars, was interviewed, as I said yesterday, by Juliet B. Wine. He passed a few comments on the Ghana national team, his chances of ever coaching them, and so many other things he spoke with Juliet Dewa about, about his superstition, about his white shirt. And on that, he told Juliet Dewa that he want two Afghans wearing that white shirt. He want him to change that. And he is superstitious sometimes, and that is normal with the very best of us even. Now, aside from that, he made this very comment that Asamoa Jan is a lazy player. I'll be giving you more details about that in today's bulletin. Also, we'll look at some amazing work David Jatasamwajan is doing on the streets of Accra, an abandoned road he is helping to uh, develop well into a more trouble road. As usual, if you're new to the channel, I advise you to subscribe to the channel and to click on the notification bell to get more updates. So we all know Baby Jet Asamwajan, highest goal scorer for the Ghana Black Stars and so many people feel that Asamwajan should have played for big clubs. However, he played for Sunderland in the English Premier League and that was the last time we heard of him from him in the top flight of football in terms of Europe. Asamwajan went on to play in the UAE and was the highest goal scorer for Ally. Many felt Asamoah Jan was chasing just money and that was all he wanted, money. Heavy Renard has come out to say that Baby Jet Asamoah Jan was a lazy player. Yes, he said that in an interview with Juliet Bewa when they were doing a Twitter chat, a live chat over the weekend. Now Asamoah Jan we always a prolific striker for the Ghana Black Stars. But you have to admit that he could have done so much more. Was he a bit more focused? But let's not jump into conclusion let me read the statement to you that herbert renard made and i'll give you my thoughts on whether truly asamoah jan is a lazy player now black stars general captain asamoah jan could have had a better football career if he worked harder in training that's according to former zambia and Cote d'ivoire coach herbert renard now renard 51 worked with chan when he was the physical trainer of Ghana in 2008 under coach Claude Ra when Ghana hosted the African Cup of Nations. He says Jan only cared about playing matches and not too much about training. Now the quality of Asamoah Jan was amazing. I was always impressed with his timing of headers. He said he was very good goal scorer, fantastic player, amazing player but I have something to tell him. He was supposed to have a better career but he was lazy. He said laughing now in training he was lazy he always likes the games but he was the most important player but I know him and he didn't like the training he only likes the competition the games he concluded Jan is Ghana's all-time highest goal scorer with 51 goals in 109 appearance he also has played at the World Cup with six goals in the World Cup making him the highest goal scorer at the World Cup tournament for Africa. So have a run out there giving his thoughts on Baby Jetta Samwajan saying he is a lazy player. Well, it depends on how you want to look at things. Many people think that a Samwajan should have aimed higher than probably going to play for the UAE, especially when he was in his prime after the 2010 World Cup in the 2010 African Cup of Nations. Ghana missing out in the final against Egypt in the African Cup of Nations and also in the quarterfinal against Uruguay in the World Cup where Samajan shone really brightly. That's when he made his move to Sunderland and leaving Sunderland he explained that in a video as to how it happened. But Asamoah was really settled on the personal terms of the contract that our I offered and Sunderland actually wanted him to leave the club. After a year at our line, they wanted him back but Samajan has settled into the atmosphere at our line and money was good so that was all he wanted throughout Asamoah career he did not play for a top team in quotes and he played China after that and finally went to Turkey before now he is with India 
to think that baby data samajan should have played could have played for top top clubs if he was more ambitious and determined is something that is really up to the man himself it depends on his representatives as well as samajan had agents who most of the time these are the people that decide the future of players we are at the back looking at things but we don't know what happens behind the scenes an agent will look at the terms of agreement of a contract and see how it suits him before he decides to agree on it before even consulting the player agents mostly are the ones that broker the deal and because they are representing the player's interests the players have to somewhat agree with them most of the time yes there is a fact that someone John could have sacked the agent if he felt they were not in his best interest but he seemed to be okay with the money for baby jetta samwajan i would say his career was about making money and he did just that to start so many businesses at baby jet airlines paradise park water he is now a businessman and doing so many amazing things with everything he has gained now heavy renard coach asamwajan in 2008 in 2008 asamwajan was under threat he wanted not to even play in the african cup of nations at the time because his family was under threat his life was under threat it took the intervention of the president john ajikum kufo to convince him to come and play and train with the national team probably that is why his enthusiasm with the national team was not at the best for heaven to witness but who is a lazy person let me just draw up the dictionary definition of a lazy person and see if heaven has a point here now a lazy person is a person who is unwilling to do work or make effort decline to exertion also idle relaxed or leisurely <laughs> showing a lack of effort or care that's a lazy person sluggish and slow moving a person who is lax so does a someone can fit in this category yeah he could probably be seen as someone who is leisure lazy but as a footballer we know the career of footballers is really short-lived if you do not make the best of financial decisions during your playing time probably you might retire without having enough money yeah we can all talk about a someone john he could have played for real madrid he could have played for chelsea he could have played for so many top clubs if he was more determined but probably he was advised to look at the monetary benefits and settle for what was available you never know the advice he was giving. You never know what was going on back home for Asamoa Jan. And probably that was his motivation. Every player has aims. Every player has people that advise them. Probably we should be playing the advices more. Who did not push Asamoa Jan beyond his limit? The player has to take some blame because eventually he will execute the advice. But Baby Jess Asamoa Jan is a great player. Herb Renard has admitted as much. But he feels Asamoa Jan could have even been greater and yeah i think we all have that belief that he could have been an even great player imagine a someone jan playing with quality players in chelsea in real madrid he would have scored so many more goals so many amazing goals for all those teams but alas it wasn't to me he was an amazing player he is an amazing player ready to play for the ghana black stars once again and it is going to be interesting to see if Siki Akono eventually calls him. But Baby Jetta Samwa Chan, in my opinion, had his priorities. And to call him lazy because he chose to make finances his priorities would be quite unfair. There are so many stories we have players who finish their careers and go broke and don't have enough money to look after themselves or their families. That is what I'm sure Baby Jetta Samwa Chan was looking to do yes he could have been better yes he could have trained harder but it depends on everyone's goal in life and probably those were not his goals to play for the top clubs was not part of his goals yeah you can say he wasn't ambitious enough but hey that's on him and not on any of us so Herb Renard has his opinion we all have our opinion but ultimately we have to know that Herb Renard trained him and he would know better than anyone the kind of player David Jetta Samuachan is let me know your thoughts in the comments box. Do you think Asamoah Jan was a lazy player? Do you think he was? Do you think he could have done better than he did with his career?
your thoughts are welcome in the comments box i'll leave you with Asamoajan's news, the news of Asamoajan helping to construct a road in Accra, the suburbs of Accra. He's doing amazing work. Despite everything you might like or might not like about the guy, he is doing stupendous work here in Ghana. After donating some PPEs to those in his area during the coronavirus pandemic, the start of the pandemic, he has done something amazing once again, helping to construct this dilapidated road here in the suburb of Accra. Kudos to him and everyone who is involved in his foundation and helping those in the communities in his small way which he feels this is the smallest thing he can do to help since he's capable of doing that kudos to him as well but let me know your thoughts on whether baby just a samwajan you think is a lazy player have renard does he have a point or should he not have said that i'll see you guys in the next one enjoy your day